My name's Andrew Sundquist. I'm an apple, pear, and cherry grower in Yakima, Washington, farming since about 2004. The farming before Phytech was, uh, it was challenging. It's hard to really know exactly what happened in the orchard just by relying on the old-fashioned ways of doing it. Without really, really good communication, it's really hard to understand exactly how the block got watered over the course of the season. What Phytech allows us to do is to know exactly what happened. Did the block get irrigated um, at the right time for the right amount of time? Was the pressure right in the orchard? The process for us was, was kind of born out of some frustration that we'd have with some older equipment um, that we had been utilizing. We, we didn't trust the data as much as we wanted to, and just because of the sheer cost of it, uh, we couldn't deploy it. And so one of the things we really liked about Phytech was once we deployed it on a ranch level, it became part of the process. Phytech helps me save water by uh, actually applying the amount of water that the crops really need. We're taking a look at what the tree is actually using on a almost minute by minute basis. We can see the reaction at different uh, soil depths, how the tree uh, has reacted to that particular irrigation, and then the resulting fruit size that, that comes from that irrigation event. On a day-to-day -day basis, we have our irrigators come in in the morning, take a look at the Phytech map of their farm, see if there's any color pop that denotes stress in the blocks, and they'll modify their schedules to, to make sure that those needs are met. As a management group, we kind of look at uh, what our, our fruit growth has been like for the week. We look at ET, weather, we make any adjustments at the beginning of the week um, utilizing the Phytech software. To anyone considering Phytech, I would say do it. It's been a, it's been a game changer for our company. Just kind of aligned us all on you know what are the needs of the tree, and it aligns management. I mean, we're all looking at the same data, and we're seeing the same things, and discussing changes that we can make, and working together to make sure that those happen.